All right, we're going to be talking about the new stuff that was announced on the JP anniversary live stream for Azure Lane. I'm just going to go over these real quick. Just going to go through everything, tell you my thoughts, feelings, etc. And also this imager, Imger, <laughs> uh, compilation was done by Kunzuku, uh, another YouTuber. Well, he posted it in my Discord for all of us, so that's great. Uh, go ahead and put link to his YouTube channel in the Twitch chat and I will also put a link down to his YouTube channel in the description below so please go ahead and go over there and check him out he's pretty cool so yeah let's go ahead and look at these I'm pretty excited because I've already kind of looked at some of this stuff so I do know I have a good idea of what I'm what I'm getting into here okay so first I want to talk about this since it's right at the beginning we'll talk about the crossover the collab event with uh, Senran Kagura I am actually a big fan of the Senran Kagura games. They are fun little, like, at least I was a big fan of Shinobi Versus, and I can't remember the other one, but they were both on, they both put them, they ported them to PC, and I got them both on Steam, and I've played both of them, and they were a lot of fun. And the main reason I ended up playing one of them is because they had, because Senran Kagura had a crossover with Ikitosen. So I got to play some of the cool characters from that game in a sort of Dynasty Warriors style combat system, which was a lot of fun. So the girls in that game, are pretty cool pretty cool characters I'm curious to see who they pick I my hope is that they will pick a character called Daidoji or not Daidoji no not Daidoji it's not Daidoji that I'm thinking of not Daidoji I'm not a, not a big fan of Daidoji um the character that I'm thinking of is Miyabi that's who I was thinking of not Daidoji I'm thinking of Miyabi I hope they pull Miyabi I highly doubt they will uh because I don't think she's like one of the standard like five characters basically they will most likely pick Asuka because she is well the main character in fact clearly this image right here if you look at it it's very clearly Asuka and like I would be really surprised if that's not Asuka right there um they'll probably pick uh Yagui Yagui I probably would be picked because she's kind of a, a laughy analog if you ask me she looks they're very similar at least in terms of appearance I wouldn't be surprised um Hibari could be a choice I could I could see them picking where is her where is it is it Homura or is it Yumi I think it's Yumi who I'm thinking of yeah Yumi they'll probably pick Yumi because she's really popular I wouldn't be surprised about that and then Ikaruga could definitely be a possibility Hikage could be a possibility Hibari would be a possibility I'd be really surprised if they picked uh, Daidoji or someone like that and I'd be really surprised if they picked Miyabi but I would love Miyabi to be in the game. So, as for those of you who've never played a Senran Kagura game or don't even know what Senran Kagura is or any of all that stuff, uh, yeah. Yeah, it's Yumi. Yeah, it's Yumi. Everybody always says Yuki because she's all kind of snow based, but yes. Uh, Yumi would be great. So, honestly, any of the characters. So, any of the characters would be cool. So, this is a, this is a cool collab. It's very, it's in the, it's in the exact same vein as Azure Lane. And for those of you who like Blue Archive, it's kind of in the same vein as Blue Archive too, if you ask me. Except ninjas, ninja girls instead of anything else. So let's go on to the next. Uh, great art, like prime, prime tier art, prime tier art. That's all I can say about. Literally, all I can say about this one is that it's, uh, it's prime. My first like reaction to this was, oh, she looks kind of cool. But then I was like, I kept looking at it more, and I was like, okay. I'm confused by the weird leg thing going on here. Like she has the like she has a boot on this side, but only has the 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 sandal on this side. So that's a little weird. But you know whatever. And then she's got the same thing going on as Emden, as far as like one eye being like a flower or a butterfly or something along those lines. She kind of reminds me. She kind of reminds me of Zero, from. She reminds me of Zero from Drakengard, just with the, the eye thing, the eye flower thing going on there. So, outside of that, I think she looks great. I think, I think it's very, it's a very simple design, I feel. I would like to see more of the gear, right? Like you can see a little bit of it here, a little bit more of it here. She has legs, boobs, and head. There is no torso. I mean, there's a torso here. You can see it. There's definitely a torso. But she's definitely got them hips and and stuff. I don't know. It's Azure Lane, man. You just, you got to do what you got to do. 
expressions are good. I'm kind of curious what her personality is going to be. I'm, I'm super curious what her personality is going to be. That's that's going to be the big thing for me. Because we've got another white hair waifu with purple eyes, so... With big booba and giant swords. So, I mean, I can't... Compl I really, honestly, legitimately can't complain about that. Is she a mommy type? Maybe. We'll see. We'll see. This is... I can't zoom in as much. Interesting. I don't like how zoomed out this is. However, I like her art. We also love a tan waifu, right? Okay. She's on a key class. And a key class. And I, I like it. I like the design. I don't know if I can get a better... Yeah. Can't really get it zoomed in too much. I like the design a lot. She kind of... However... Yeah, this is clearly Dish's art. As soon as I saw it, I was like, this has got to be Dishwasher, right? This is definitely Dish. This is definitely Dish. I'm curious what her personality is going to be. I love the coat. I want to I want to point that out real quick. This freaking, like, sort of, not fur, but, like, cashmere-looking sweater coat. Like, I like it a lot. I like the design. I love this design. This is, so far, I think this might be my favorite design of these new ships. So she is another destroyer. Akazuki class, I mean, whatever. Like, I look at this design, and I'm like, okay, another IJN destroyer with horns and a fierce look and the sword and the thing and stuff. Okay, whatever. Boring. Boring. Boring design. Boring. Boring. This, this character is boring. Another IJN destroyer? Whoopty freaking who. Yay. Yay. Moving on. That's, there's my hot take. We got this one. I mean, she's a tiny fox elf girl. I don't know what's going on here. I don't know what's going on here. She doesn't, she has horns. Oh, she has horns. Okay. Is she another cow? No, she's a lizard. Is she a dragon? Hold on a second. Is she a dragon? Yeah, she's a dragon tail. I just threw the dragon tail. Okay. So, she's cute. That's about it. She's got horns, elf ears, and a dragon tail. So... She's another dragon. She got a lot of expressions. Hold it, this expression right here. I'm not gonna lie, this expression though. <laughs> Alright, next. What is this monstrosity? Is there official art for this already? No. No, there's not. Okay. No. I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like the energy this character gives off. I don't like anything about this. I don't like it. Weapon skins. Now these weapon skins, these are pretty cool. I like these weapon skins. These are pretty cool. I like this. I like the little little fat fox. <laughs> little fat fox. A kappa. Little, okay. These are cool. I like these a lot. The little talismans and stuff. These are cool. These are cool. These are all cool. But I really want the chonky fox, yeah. The fox is a plain skin? Nice. Shinano time? Yes. Absolutely. Definitely need these for Shinano. I assume these are shells. These are probably like torpedoes or bullets. This dorm set looks pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. Kind of a cool looking dorm set. This is a pretty, pretty good, pretty good looking dorm set. A little spooky. I like the spooky, like, spookiness of this event. You know, very, um, yokai, like, yokai oriented. I like it. Fox spirits, all that stuff. I already know what the description is, Bill. Probably skip it, as usual. Alright, now we'll get into skins. Oh boy. Oh boy. Can we open this another tab? Zoom in more? Yeah. Damn. Damn. That's all I can say on this one. Fucking damn. Okay. Sure. Why not? Eh, no. Hell no. Nah, I'm good. So basically the next like one, two, three, eh, cute, but no. Four skins are like a nah for me. I'm just gonna say that right now. I'm just gonna say that right now. No, it's not, Bill. It's not. But the next those next four skins are just basically just I don't care. So now there's this one. Finally, a Hakuryu skin that I want. Okay? 
Finally, a Hakari skin that I want. This looks pretty cool. And it's L2D. So, yeah. She looks cute. She looks she's playing a little, little, I forgot what it's called. It's not a banjo, it's the Japanese version. But uh, a Biwa? Is it a Biwa? I think it might be a Biwa. Or Sami Sen, thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely, definitely uh, gonna get this one. Another skin for the cowgirl, the large cowgirl. Another, another, another Kashino skin. Cash cow, yeah. I'm not gonna lie though. I'm not gonna lie. I, I do kind of like it. It's, I don't know why, but I do kind of like it. I'm not buying this one until I see the animations. Yo. Fair enough. Fair enough. I wasn't a big fan of the last one, but I don't know. I kind of like it. Neuron activation. Yeah, basically. <laughs> this is for Argus. I think. Right? This is Argus. Argus and Prince of Wales. And this Prince of Wales skin. Wow. The Prince of Wales skin. Now that is a... Uh, woof. I'm not a butt guy. But sometimes. Every once in a while. I'm just saying. I like the Argus one too. It's cute. That Prince of Wales skin. Hmm. I might have, I'll probably have to get that one on the um, on the HMS only account. Cake be caking, yeah. Cake be caking, for sure. I also like the I like the angle. Um, you know, a buck. I'm not usually. I'm really am not honestly. But every once in a while, I'm just saying. Every once in a while, you know, you, you, you know, you get a nice nice curve there. You know, you get, you know I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. The one thing I like about this Argus skin is the angle. Like the the like the the view angle because it's a little bit different than what we're used to seeing, right? Instead of it being like a down angle or a side angle or something like that, it's like kind of an up angle, kind of like looking down. It's good. Yeah, the mirror. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see the mirror too. Yeah, it's good. It's very good. There's a couple of skins with mirrors, mirrors in them. Alright, this is... Don't care. I This is another one of the Noshiro sisters. I don't care. And then a Nimi skin. It looks cool. I like it. He bought the Aegir skin despite it having feet because of the cake. Uh, Bill, I, I don't have a skin for Aegir. What are you talking about? Looking down on them girls, I see. I mean, soon. I'm like six foot six. So that's basically all that ever happens between me and my girlfriend. Is me looking down because she's like five four. Okay? <laughs> so yes. That is exactly what happens. I'm always be looking down on them girls. <laughs> Holy shit, a giant, yes. <laughs> All right, now for the piece de la resistance. Oh, oh boy. My wallet is screaming at me. My wallet is screaming at me. <laughs> From below is usually reserved for leaders in the leg, yeah. Yeah. My wallet is screaming at me. Just absolutely freaking screaming. Absolutely screaming. In every way too. And it's live and it's live 2D. And it's live 2D. I Oh god. I just I just I can't. You saw the LTD preview? No, I have not seen the LTD preview. I will look at it. I will look at it later. But goddamn. God damn. And then, honestly, frankly, um, I like this skin. I like this skin. However, I like the skin. However, it's this is the skin where I look at her and I like her body proportion. The angles are just a little too off, right? Like her center. Like her, her chest, like you guys can't see, but her, like her chest, not her chest, but like her torso here is actually non-existent. Like the, the body anatomy just doesn't, doesn't look that great. Yeah. What proportion? Exactly. There's the body anatomy here is a little off and like, she's kind of got that. Um, what the hell is that character? It's another key. It's key. She's kind of got that key thing going on where her, like her leg is just like freaking like so massive it's most of her butt like it's just 
I don't know. I like it, but at the same time, I'm like, I shouldn't like it. I shouldn't like this skin, but I like the skin. You know what I'm saying? It's that neuron activation thing again. Another one of those, her base art is so good, the skin is tough to be better. I agree. I, I agree. But yeah, it's a little, it's it's weird. It's this whole, this whole area right here, it's just weird. I feel like there just needs to be like a little bit less. Like there's a little bit less and a little bit less leg. And I think, I think the skin comes out way better. Personally. But, but this one. Uh, Shimikaze, whatever, moving on. Uh, UVH. Honestly, honestly, it's kind of not great. I'm not going to lie. This is not great. Any Ember Link? I got you. There you go, Mort. Welcome back to the stream, by the way. Yeah, this is kind of a mid, mid, mid skin, not going to lie. UVH in general, outside of her base art, I really regret buying her 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 skin because they're just all kind of mid. They're super mid. Yes, link brought to you by Kunzuku TV. Lutzal Oat skin. I like this a lot. I like this skin a lot. I like the pose. I like the the the, the colors. I like everything about this skin. This is such a good oat skin. I love it. I think it's fantastic. She was your first out? Yes, I remember that. I do remember that. And I'm really surprised it took this long. A Burmerton skin. And I'm not going to lie, not a fan. Not a fan. This is this is not this is not good. I don't think this oat skin's very good at all. I I don't like it. I don't like it. I'm surprised it took this long, and what we're getting, it feels way too plain. The ribbon is horrible. Yeah, the ribbon is horrible. The whole skin, like everything about this is just terrible. What's bad about it? I don't like the ribbon. I don't like the dress. I don't like the coloring. I don't like the background. I don't like the pose. I don't like, like, I don't like any of it. Um, who this? Who this? Skin for you, 410. Sure, whatever. Lame. Who this? Princeton? Oh, a Princeton meta. Huh. Interesting. Okay. Okay. Princeton meta. Interesting. Looks good. I like it. But that's going to be the next, what, elite, right? Plus one CV reload is all I see. There you go. There you go. All right. Oh, that's right. Chapter 15. Chapter 15 is about to come out. Let's go. That's right. I totally forgot about that. For me, it's kind of pointless. Will they be pee? You shut your mouth. You shut, you shut your mouth, Ken. You shut your mouth. For me is not pointless because of AVP. AVP wishes she was as awesome as Formidable. You shut your mouth. Anyways, chapter 15. I don't know who this is. What's her name? I don't know who this is, but I like her. Oh, it is Houston. Yeah, it, is, it literally says it. It literally says it on her coat. <laughs> I mean, she looks really cool. I, I will say this again. I really do like the Eagle Union's siren futuristic designs to their ships like the more and more i look at it the more i'm like i like everything about this design taiochi is happy probably <laughs> another cleveland class let's go but super excited for world 15 super excited for world 13 hard mode super excited for tempesta also this is probably the best update in the entire game this right here, the best update in the entire game. New cats. Actual new cats. Um, Shinano re or uh, 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 Shimikaze rerun. Shimikaze rerun, right? I'm pretty sure this is the the, the promotional art for Shimikaze. All right. Well then. So we'll blah, blah, real quick a quick recap of this. We've got a new UR ship for the 6th anniversary for the Japanese server. We've got great art. We've got a new UR coming in, who I'm super excited for. We've got another um, 
Uh, <laughs> got uh, IGN Owari, which I'm super excited for. Don't care about her. Don't care about her. I think she's cute, but don't care about her. Don't care about her. Don't care. The skins look cool. The dorm set looks awesome. New game mode. Don't care. Skin looks good. Don't care. Don't care. Don't care. Don't care. Looks good. Maybe. Cool. Looks good. Looks great. Don't care. Looks good. Definitely buying. Maybe you'll buy that. Nah. No. Mid. Kind of bad, actually. Mm, going on. Going on. Reruns of skins. Reruns of skins. This looks pretty cool. Honestly, probably one of the better oaths I've ever seen. This is really great. Honestly, kind of trash. Whatever. Looks cool. Whatever. Whatever. Also, one of my favorite designs in the game now. I really like this design. I can't wait to have more of it. More tentacles, please. Best update the game has ever received. More cats. And Shimakaze rerun. That is my opinion on everything that was announced on for the sixth uh, the sixth anniversary for Azure Lane. So, yeah, that's going to be a wrap for this one. I'll see you guys later.